So guys, one question. Doesn't that look absolutely awesome? The At Games Legends Bit LCD may be the most important upgrade to your At Games Legends Ultimate. Hey guys, Michael B. The Game Genie here. Thank you so very much for watching. In today's video, we're going to be taking a look at the At Games Legends Bit LCD. This add-on marquee for your At Games Legends Ultimate not only looks awesome, but it adds some much needed nostalgia to what would otherwise be a pretty bland multicade. And I'm going to tell you more about it right after this. So that's right guys, in today's video we're going to be talking about the At Games Bit LCD and I want to tell you why I think this may be the best upgrade to your At Games Legends Ultimate. But before we get into that, I want to say thank you so much everybody for checking out the video. Guys, I always appreciate your support. If this is your first time to the channel and you like what you see, go ahead and subscribe. Click the bell for notifications. All that YouTube stuff. So you guys know I'm a pretty big fan of the At Games Legends Ultimate. This home arcade also poses as a multicade where you can bring your own games to it and play pretty much anything you could ever want. The only real downside of the arcade itself is the fact that visually it's not as nice looking as some of its competitors offerings. And one big knock on it is while you can play all the retro games you've ever wanted, it doesn't bring a lot of nostalgia to the table other than being able to play the games. You don't get the warm and cozy feeling of sitting in the arcade with the memory of the marquee, the control panel, the side art, all the stuff that touches that nostalgia bone we all have inside. Lucky for us, At Games has come out with an apparent fix in the form of an accessory for one of those issues with the Bit LCD marquee. And I want to say thank you so much to At Games for sending me out this copy of the Bit LCD for the purpose of this review. Alright guys, let's take a peek inside the box and see what's included with the Bit LCD marquee. You're going to open it up and immediately notice... Cardboard! So much cardboard covering up the front of the marquee. Inside you'll see the instruction manual there and then another protective foam layer underneath also trying to protect the marquee. Here we have a bunch of cables <laughs> for you to plug in your bit LCD marquee. There's some screw covers, which you're going to need for the installation. Trust me, guys, the installation is pretty easily. You've got a USB cable, and there's going to be some other wacky stuff here. You've also got a USB hub that, believe it or not, is going to be necessary in order to hook up this marquee. With all that stuff out of the way, let's take the protective foam layer off, finally. And wrapped in plastic is, in fact, the Bit LCD marquee in all its glory. Be very careful taking this stuff out, guys. You don't want to damage this. This looks so good. Now, guys, here's where people would typically do an installation video, and I can do that because it is super easy to install. However, this is me talking. I'm not much of a modder. You guys don't need to see that train wreck. But if you are in fact looking for a in-depth guide on how to set up your Legends Bit LCD and get the most out of it, I advise you to go check out my buddy John Wagner, Wagner's Tech Talk. He has a guide set up on his website that will show you everything you need to know about setting up your At Games Legends Bit LCD marquee. I will leave a link in the description below, help you out. Everything you need to do piece by piece, John has it covered. And for those of you people that are visual learners, quite like myself, John also has some great guides up on YouTube. They are also linked in his website in the guide description page. So if you want to see firsthand someone setting up their Legends Bit LCD, check John out. So, guys, once you get your Bit LCD installed to the cabinet, and install the Bit LCD firmware. Once you go to games, you'll be able to receive dedicated marquees for at games stock games on the cabinet. This will allow you to see pictures that they have done, which is either the original marquee 
or a facsimile of the original marquee plus the on-screen game logo where the marquee would be slightly distorted if they went the full size of the Legends bit LCD. So these are pretty cool and add that extra level of flair or nostalgia to the Alak Games Legends Ultimate where otherwise it wouldn't be there. Well, that, that's pretty neat, I guess, right? I mean, now there is some facsimile of Marquis for the stock games that come with the Legends Ultimate and the games you can download. But let's be real here. A lot of us aren't buying the Legends Ultimate just to play the stock games. No. For those of us who dabble in the dark arts and add additional ROMs to our arcades, what about those games? Can we get marquees for those as well? So guys, if you're looking to add custom marquees for your games, either bring your own game or through CoinOps X, you don't have to look very far. Check out At Games longtime fanboy and member, P Dubs Arcade Loft. He's got a bunch of videos up on YouTube, how to add marquees, and most importantly, the CoinOps X Bit LCD Marquee Pack 2.0. So guys, in P-Dub's video, he will do a step-by-step -step tutorial on how exactly you get the additional marquees added so that you can have every single game available for CoinOps X 5.0. That means pretty much every single game will have a custom marquee and where no licensing is involved here and no problems, they're the original marquees. And like always, I'll be helpful here and I will leave a link down in the description below to P-Dub's video so you can easily access it. So once you get your Legends Bit LCD, if you don't have one already, check out his video and add your additional marquees. So once you download the Community Marquee Pack and big on the community for doing this, that's one of the great things about the At Games Legends community. There's people out there that want to share this experience with everybody. They go out and they find the ROMs, they put them in packages, they go out and get the marquees, and they're constantly doing creations and evolvements that benefit everybody. So kudos to the At Games community, and specifically the people making these legend marquees and legend marquee packs, so people like me don't have to. Now, that being said, you can make your own marquees if you so want to, but I do suggest maybe go grab one from somebody in the community. It will definitely save you some time there. So on top of that, one of the other cool things that the community have done is in fact added menus to their marquee packs because once you download your Legends Bit LCD marquee firmware, for some reason, I don't know if this is currently, but the original firmware didn't actually have uh, menus for the At Games Legends Bit LCD. So it would just be a black screen with white text. Thankfully, the community knew this would be an eyesore and developed menu items. So when you're scrolling through different things like your settings or if you're going to, you know, uh, the Legends shop or if you're looking for coin OpsX, they've created menu marquees so the machine will look pretty even when you're not scrolling through games or in a game. Now once you get into CoinOps X, you can take a look through the available marquee images that have been added to this pack, and this truly shows you what the At Games Legends Bit LCD is capable of. Every single arcade game just about that you can look for has a marquee image. Now, most of them have been perfectly stretched to fit the size of the marquee, or even some of the original marquees have extended artwork to make it look crisp and clear on the Legends Bit LCD, while others are cropped a little bit and have things added to the side, but everything looks really cool. While some are not 1,000% arcade authentic they did a very good job of bringing them into the future the size of this marquee keeping the nostalgia and making it work another thing i want to say is at games spared no expense with this lcd screen the picture quality is fantastic no matter which marquee gets brought up in the images whether it be one of the stock at games marquees or the marquees added by the community it's a bright beautiful picture the colors look right the picture is crisp and clear the quality of this lcd panel is fantastic 
When it comes right down to it though, the most important thing about the Legends Bit LCD is it adds a new pop of color and a certain element of nostalgia to what would be an otherwise pretty bland multicade. Let's face it, most multicades do exactly what they're supposed to do. They let you play an array of arcade games, some with different controls, some with uh, different button configurations, but at the end of the day, there's certain concessions made in order to make a multicade work that take away from the nostalgia of people looking for that fill. Here with the Legends Ultimate, there have been many complaints about the arcade from people that are more interested in, let's say, an arcade one-up or some kind of arcade recreation that are obviously missing that level of nostalgia. Whether it be they don't like the swan neck design, whether it be they don't like the artwork on the Legends Ultimate, whether they don't like the plainness of the marquee just with Legends Ultimate up there. This adds a new pop of color and that wave of nostalgia when you see one of your favorite games, marquees, clearly displayed above you. It might not be the actual um, control panel art, you might not be getting the whole package, but at least with the marquee, you are getting that sense of familiarity, somewhere you've been before. Me personally, I love sitting down, grabbing the twin sticks on this thing, playing away at Robotron, and if I look up or walk towards the machine, seeing that familiar marquee just brings me a wave of happiness I wouldn't have otherwise got. So guys, if you are interested in picking up the Act Games Bit LCD Marquee Accessory, you can head on over to the Act Games eStore. They are currently there for $349.99. Ships in 7 to 10 business days. Shipping is about $25. That is a highly steep price, I know. And how much is your nostalgia worth to you? However, if you are a Legends Platinum owner, you can avail of their current deals, which are ongoing, you can save 25.7% for your LPO membership, and it will be $259.99. Unfortunately, for those of us here in Canada, us knuckleheads, the At Games Bit LCD isn't currently available at retail and At Games doesn't ship to Canada. Hopefully, either the Brick or Buy Stuff store, the At Games Canadian distributors or Canadian retailers, do get some available soon because this is an excellent product. One of the reasons I was so excited about getting this product for the purpose of this review was that it currently wasn't available in Canada. Hopefully it will be available to everybody else in the near future. Anyways guys, let me know in the comments what do you think of the At Games Legends Bit LCD? Is this something you guys are interested in? Or if you already have one, do you agree with my assessment? Is it a really cool product? You think it's worth the bang for your buck? And it does add that missing nostalgia that you don't normally get from the Legends Ultimate. For those of you who think it's too highly priced, you're not an LPO member, keep in mind that At Games do sales all the time, whether it's one of their um, National Owners Day sales, they usually do this with a similar price point, if not cheaper, to the Legends Platinum Owner plan, so wait it out until it goes on sale. Anyways guys, I wanted to say thank you so very much for watching. I always appreciate your support. This is Michael B. The Game Genie. I'll talk to you next time.